January 15th. Today was horrid because Anthony moved and I missed two days of school and I cried. January 16th. Oh boy. Today my heart stopped beating and my dream came true. I wished and wished on Christmas Eve that Anthony P. would come back again. And he did. I thought it would die. He is everything a girl could dream of. Cute, smart, strong, good Christian. See, Mom? And a good sense of humor. S-E-N-S. -S. Humor. H-U-M-E-R. Tall. Captain of the football team. By the way, I didn't know Dearborn Christian School had a football team. Nice hair of pitch black. And it is feathered. Very long. Eyelashes and Italian. E-T-I-A-L-A-N. We're going to skip to January 28th, January 18th. Now everything was going great. He was really nice to me, Anthony, by the way, and I sat right next to him. But I did not show my feelings about him because it is still painful for me, and I'm not sure he knows. I know you're dying. Let's just do one more day. January 19th. Every time... I try to tell my mom, Barbara Pomeroli, about my feelings. She says it is only a little crush, but it isn't.